What did you want everyone and welcome back. Um I had to get my camera working back again. I had to give it a break for a couple minutes because it was acting all weird on me, so yeah, you know, it goes. Camera acts weird, you gotta sit down for a minute and be like, alright, take a break, take a break. So earlier we did the review for the drama series. With whom I wish for better say. Now we're doing a CD release from God, when was this? 2008. Yikes! And the CD in question is Noble. All right. I'm going to say this right now. Do this or don't because you may not want to. <clears throat> Go grab this C, which is the Jubilee C, which, by the way, the scene will not be being done because I have a text review of this up on my neolog on CD Japan's uh, site. So this scene will not be being done. And I'm just debating whether or not I want to do Holy Grail, but I'll explain why in a minute. If this is the first CD you've listened to, and then you go to listen to to this CD. Well, guess what's going to happen, kids? You're going to have an issue. Now, it's not a bad issue. Not in the sense of, oh my god, we're screwed. But, when you try to listen to a group with a different lineup, it can sometimes mess with you a little bit. See, most of the songs off of this particular album, in my personal opinion, sound a little bit more like a symphonic metal group, or like, they sound a little bit more melodic. Okay? When you listen to this CD, they sound a little bit harder than normal. And there was one song on here, which was... I want to say it was History of the Other Side. I'm trying to remember exactly. It was either that or to the... It was either that, I'm guessing it was either that or to the cast. Inside. I, I forget right now, right offhand. But there was just one song, it was like nine minutes. Guess what, kids? It wasn't Aristocrat Symphony, and it wasn't the Revenant Choir. Like I'm listening to this song, and I look, I'm literally looking over at my TV screen because, in case anybody doesn't know, I don't have a CD player in this room, so I have to use my PlayStation 2 for my CD player. So I'm using this thing. So I'm using that to play this thing. And I'm looking like, Sony ain't over yet? <laughs> not that I wanted, not, not that I was in a rush or anything, but I was like, damn. But my general rule when it comes to uh, groups is I try to listen with an open mind, and I did listen to this CD with an open mind. Was it bad? No, not by a long shot. Not by a long shot at all. It was actually a very good CD. Here's the thing. If you hear a song like Episode or Windows, Windows, those sound more like what you would hear off of the Jubilee CD. If you hear a song 
like a Rich Request Symphony to the Reverend Choir. Let's see what's another. Ah, I did it again. The Revenant Choir. Uh, let's see, what was another one that would be a good example of this? Uh, Antique in the Antique in the Future, which I accidentally called Furniture at one point. You're going, yep, that's what I almost expected the group to be like from the start. In other words, a lot of harder edge stuff. And again, nothing wrong with that, kids. It's just the simple fact that once you've listened to a song like Reminiscence, Amorphous, uh, hell, even Desert Apple, you tend to look at it and go, hmm. And you just stop. And you go, well, that is drastically different than what I was expecting here. And then again, I think it also may have had to do with, again, the lineup. And by the way, here's one. I was watching the music video for Aristocrat Symphony off this. And because this comes with the DVD, which has Aristocrat Symphony on it, which is. Hold on. which is that DVD right there. Okay. First off, when you're watching that and you're looking at the video, you're going, wow. <laughs> it, looks, it looks so different between then and now that you're, you're, you're sitting there going, <laughs> Musically, the uh, songs sound as you would, like I said, probably expect if you were expecting it to be a, the group to consistently be a more harder edge group. Maybe that's attributed to when, and I'm not blaming for anybody who's. Jazz group when Jasmine you was the basis. I'm not blaming Jasmine. It seems like the songs were a hell of a lot harder though between then and Jubilee. Could just be me. But uh I could like names for some of these songs. Uh what's well, I'm, I'm trying to remember what song that was. It was nine minutes. I'm trying to remember if it was, and I honestly can't remember it offhand. I do know for a fact that when I watched that now, when I watched that video, I listened to. I'm watching it right. I said, and I went, <clears throat> I went, hey, Aristocrat Symphony and the Revenant Choir called. Get a grip. Because <laughs> believe it or not, the video for. First Crest Symphony was only like seven minutes. What was kind of interesting though, what was actually what was really cool was this as the song ends and they were winning the credits for it. They played the song episode to go over the credits, which was really neat. Now with this all being said, would I recommend the CD? I'll recommend it in this sense. If you like harder edge stuff, the CD is going to be for you. If you like it to be a little bit more, with a little bit more of a melody or melodic, you might be better off skipping it and going straight to Jubilee. But maybe that's just me. Because, like I said, it's not a bad CD at all. It's actually really good. But it will not appeal if you're a harder, if you're not one of those people who's used to harder and stuff. I am, so it kind of doesn't bother me. It screws with you a little bit, but it's not too bad. 
like I say, I've been there and I've probably heard, you know, stuff that makes you go, shoosh. But uh, that will be the review. Uh, I do suggest that you pick it up if you want to get if you want to get started on listening to the group. You might want to start with this one and go in to Jubilee, so you're not like going all the way around like I did, just have it completely your head up. But that is going to do it. For this review, I'm debating whether I'm going to do Holy Grail today or we'll wait till another day. But until then, my friends, I will talk to you later. Good day.